Hi, uh, welcome to another Excel tutorials from Digital Answers. In this tutorial, we're going to see how to import a text file into Excel 2013. So, let me launch uh, Excel 2013. Now, I've already got an Excel file. Let me just open. Uh, sorry, a text file containing name and some number so now I'm going to try to import this file into Excel so you've got a blank worksheet now let's click on the insert menu now uh, under insert menu uh, sorry yeah. I think. yeah it's not insert menu it's under uh, data so data menu navigate to get external data and here you have an option called from text so click from text now I'm selecting the text file which contains the data and then I'm going for the import option so now you should see the text import wizard uh, window and it's asking you what is the delimiter uh, which is being used in this text file characters such as commas so choose the field type and uh, my data doesn't have have any headers so has headers so I'm just going ignoring this checkbox and then next So this screen lets you in the next step we are going to specify okay exactly uh, what is that your what is the delimiter you, you are using in your text file is it tab or semicolon and I'm I'm using tab and since there are more than one uh, tab used in my text field so I'm just going to say treat consecutive tabs delimiters as one so now you could see the difference before having check before unchecking mean when I had this option unchecked you could see some values going to the third column but after checking this column uh, checking this option you could see all aligned in one single column so now you can just preview the data and if everything is okay click next column date format it's basically I don't have any date or uh, other uh, different format so I'm just going for general text and this also I'm going to go for uh, general da data format so let's just click finish now it's asking where do you want to insert this so you can uh, in the existing worksheet you can just select the row and column where you want to uh, put the data so I'm just going for the default option click OK so now you got the data from uh, text file imported to your excel hope you find this useful thank you